Agatha is the gayest, 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 gayest. I love gay people. They should be great. I'm the biggest fan of WandaVision, and when I heard this show was being made, I went... No, no, don't do it. No, no, don't do it. No, 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 don't do it. It's time to stop. But I know better than to fuck around with Kevin Feige, so I watched Agatha all along. And here are the three things you uncover after watching this video. What Agatha is really about, is it bad or woke? And most importantly, should you waste time watching this show? Agatha All Along is about Agatha breaking free of Wanda's curse after WandaVision. And I gotta say, I loved her in that show. I beat my meat every time I see her on the screen. The series is set in Westview where Wanda tortured a bunch of virgins and a lot of the WandaVision characters cameo. Now the main story focuses on Agatha going around collecting Pokemon cards or badass witches and setting them on a journey to a witch camp so that they can recover their witchcraft powers. Isn't that a little bit wild for your younger audience, Kevin? Pa okay, okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That's the whole story and plot of the series leading us to is this show bad the answer to this is if you find the story and plot uninteresting from what i've seen the story is kind of made because no one really cares about agatha except me of course but i gotta say the first episode is really really good and i promise it's not because agatha was naked in that one scene thanks kevin feige for flashing me her ass what did I do? It was really good because how Agatha broke out of Wanda's curse is very, very well made. Even though the story is mad, the plot is quite interesting. Plus, the characters we are following are quite interesting. Hmm, what a handsome little fella. I hope he's not gay. Sorry, he worries. <laughs> Of course he's gay. It wouldn't be Disney if he wasn't. I honestly don't know why people are calling this the gayest Marvel series because, I mean, the gay is just a little bit. And who really cares? We are in for entertainment. We don't care who is gay. I mean, I love my gay homies, even though I'm Christian. Now, what the fuck? If the show interests you, watch it. Forget this whole it is gay and gay gay shit. We don't care. Don't let this gay stuff stop you from watching a good series. <laughs> There are only two reasons why you should watch this series. First reason is the main character. Trust me when I say you're gonna love Agatha. Every second she's in is just awesome. She is a female boss character done right. Disney finally got it right and I think you should watch it just for Agatha. Just for his god dropping awesome performance. Second reason is if you genuinely enjoyed WandaVision. I'm sorry but if you liked WandaVision like me you have no choice but to watch it. Watch it because it's just just the same vibe as one division it got the same vibe it is slow paced and it is very entertaining at times i didn't like this show when it got announced but trust me when i say it has the potential to be a good show ordinary marvel fans wouldn't enjoy it quite as much but hey let's congrats disney for trying out something new now i know that i keep saying i love one division and agatha but you shouldn't believe me without proof so watch the short film i made three years ago when one division first aired just to know that i'm not kidding when i say I love Agatha.